hello guys in this video i will show you how you can do an assignment on microsoft word app on your mobile i am using the microsoft word app in the android mobile but if you are an iphone user doesn't matter uh, this tutorial is applicable to you also so if you're here for this purpose then keep on watching so in order to start the assignment we are going to open the app and from the top right plus menu we're going to start with the blank document so first of all we're going to give uh, the heading so after you have written the heading now is the time to format this you can uh, uh, bold your heading by pressing this uh, b or you can also press this um, icon let me show you again this alphabet with a pen on the top if you click this you will get all the tabs which you generally get on your uh, microsoft word uh, software on your windows right now as you can see that this is the home tab it is shown here and all the home uh, tab features are mentioned here so i can uh, change the font color so let me highlight the heading so i can change the font color i can also go back and uh, do it make the heading uh, center line and then i'll just click uh, somewhere else and press enter so and from here on i am going to make it left line and uh, i'm going to start writing i will not waste your time i'll just write one sentence and then i will also show you how you can insert the table pictures and the shapes uh, if you want to add these in your assignment also so um, from here on you can just start to write so i'm just going to change the color back to black because this doesn't look uh, professional so uh, i'm going to select the text um, of the paragraph and i'm going to make it unbold i will just go back to the formatting i'll just do it uh, justified and i will also give it a paragraph numbering by clicking this number and then clicking one and as you can see that our paragraph number has also so it started now if my this first paragraph is over i can just do the uh, enter and my second paragraph would start so by now i would uh, assume that you know that how you can write uh, in the uh, assignment and now i will show you that if you have to uh, insert a table how would you do that so again you would uh, press the enter where you want to insert a table click this again um, uh, icon which is on the top uh, with the symbol a and uh, a pen and from here you can go to uh, this menu which is uh, on the top left if you click that you will see all the tabs so a bar right now we are on a home tab in order to insert a table we need to go to the insert tab so here you would see that the menu has changed and now all the um, options which are, are usually there in the uh, insert uh, tab are shown and here i can see that there is a table so by default it is three by three and you can uh, insert the rows below or you can insert the column towards the right so this is how you can increase uh, the size um, of the table by increasing the number of rows and uh, the uh, columns the next thing is that how you can insert a picture we would again stay into the insert tab and there is an option of a picture and from here you can select the photos and from your you can select the photos or you can uh, from your uh, gallery or you can take a new photo by selecting the camera and your photo will be inserted so i have selected this photo um, i can crop this photo before inserting into the uh, my assignment document and i can confirm then press done and my photo will be inserted and now uh, there is another problem that once the photo is inserted generally i have seen a lot of queries that how you can uh, move this uh, photo in the uh, microsoft word so the uh, tip is that once you select the photo uh, you can uh, click uh, either side of the photo and you can reduce the photo size and you can press this wrap text and press this square which will help you to move the photo anywhere in the document as i you can see that i'm moving this uh, right now i'll just uh, move this to below the uh, table 
so you can add the shadows you can add that reflection just like uh, you could add in the um, on your laptop so i will just add a border onto this uh, photo and as you can see that um, this is uh, inserted uh, over here now the last thing is uh, that uh, how uh, we are going to insert a shape i'm just going to highlight this and move the photo towards the right because we need to insert our shapes over here so we are going to click this again go to this tab go to insert tab and from here click say as uh, shapes and from here you can click the arrow and your shape will be inserted as i have inserted the um, circle and you can also change the colors change the outline color and you can also um, change the shape style as you can see that here uh, a number of options are available just like you would have in the actual microsoft word on your laptop and but last thing is that with if i click ok and if i go back my document will be saved i need to rename it so i can open this document click this document one and i can uh, give a name to this document and now if uh, we have to take a print out of this document from the mobile i can go to these three vertical dots and from here i can click uh, print or i can uh, save this document as pdf or share it as a pdf or i can take a print but if you have to just submit an assignment then it is better that you share it as a pdf so i've just clicked this share as pdf which is going to take some time to convert this into pdf document so now your assignment is ready and if you want to send this assignment uh, online you can just click uh, three vertical dots and you can click either save as and save it in your device or you can or you can um, go and click share as pdf and you can share this uh, pdf file uh, with the help of any app like whatsapp you can do an email and you can even save it in your google drive and then share the link to your uh, in teacher and if you want to take a print out of uh, this you can just go and click print and now this is the print preview and you can uh, select the paper size i'll just change the paper size to to legal i'll keep the orientation as portrait color default and uh, um, since there is only one page uh, so i'm just going to click save click save and just go into uh, this uh, document and you can uh, see for yourself by clicking this and you can see that almost all the options of uh, view review um, and then insert uh, home all tabs are there so you would find all the features which are generally available in the microsoft word uh, in your laptop or pc uh, that would be available here if there is anything which i have not covered in this uh, tutorial and you were looking for that uh, uh, you can ask me in the comment section below uh, thanks for watching like share and subscribe